I can't do it. I can't. I keep right, laughing. This here. is too hard this. to do it. <laughs> just wait. <laughs> Comes off a rare flower called the fade leaf. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, hey guys, my name is Corey Bannerman. This is my first vlog. I'm making a little vlog series on YouTube, so subscribe. But I'll uh, introduce myself first. Uh, yeah, if you're coming from WarcraftMovies.com, you know kind of like what I'm about. I make WoW movies. Um, here's a quick clip. Implies. Entertain yourself for a while. I'll catch up with you later. <sighs> Oh, yeah. I'm running low. Good time to get a drink, don't you think? You're buying. Yeah, I guess it couldn't hurt. I'll take some rope, some bread, and... So, I, so it turns out I woke up and it was a brother! <laughs> I love this guy! I'll take a jug of water. Ooh, these look nice. I like this guy's face. I'm gonna buy him a drink. So yeah, um, there's there's a clip from Adventures of Thorn one. Um, I also did a series called My Life for the Horde. I'm not gonna get too into that. Um, I posted on the title of the video My Life for the Horde. I don't know if that's gonna happen, but I'm pretty much gonna let you know what I'm working on right now and you know it might be an option for the future, but I mean my last movie turned out I wasn't very happy with it. It was good for the Warcraft fanboys, but other than that, you know um, it's, You know, I'm glad people enjoyed it. Some people actually enjoyed my life for the horde too. You know, I won second um, with X-Fire, but you know, it's just funny. It's pretty much just the Warcraft fans that liked it. If you read the comments, it's like, My Life for the Horde, and the Horde's spelled wrong, and it's like, No for the Alliance, and for Thrall, and it's cool in that aspect. Beville Productions now, no more Nailbog Trolls Productions, no more Bannerman Productions. If you're not familiar with um, Warcraft movies, or Machinima movies for that, pretty much just movies you make using video game software, and using Warcraft, um, Model Viewer and you know Chroma King and all these different cool things you can make some extraordinary movies. I mean, look at Tales of the Past Three. Like that's why I'm doing this and that's why I bought this video camera so I can uh, pretty much record the whole process of me making Ventures of Thorn Two. It's not just going to be the process of you know the editing or whatever. It's going to be the whole thing. We've almost got the script done. We're finishing the rest tonight. And I mean, I'm gonna record, get some footage of that, of us finishing the script and the read throughs of it, the edits of it. And I wanna record all that on the video camera so you guys can watch. I haven't seen very many uh, videos that, you know, show you a start to finish of how some people make their movies and stuff like that. So, you know, I hope you guys subscribe and uh, check me out. Adventures Thorn 2, the trailer's coming. Um, we're doing voiceovers tomorrow. You know, I'll probably record that and maybe show you guys that later. Later on in the week, we're going to do some recordings and I'm going to, you know, scoop out a quick trailer of Adventures of Thorn 2. I mean, it's going to be a phenomenal movie and I hope you guys enjoy it in the end. It's the funniest script, by far the funniest script we've ever written. Me and my brother, Shane, Shane, I'll subscribe. Um, it's over that way. Everything's in reverse, my little viewfinder. Yeah. Subscribe there if you're on YouTube. Adventures of Thorn 2, or Adventures of Thorn 1, if you haven't seen it. You know, it gets, it's kind of slow at the beginning, but I mean, get like two minutes into it and it just starts getting funny. I mean, it's not the funniest movie out, but I mean, it's a build up to the next film. The next film's going to be hilarious, so. If you're on WarcraftMovies.com, you know, it's down there. And if you're on YouTube, it is over there. Sidebar. Anyway. I'll be uploading more videos later, maybe tonight or tomorrow or later this week. So, yeah, I got a remote. What's the point of using this? That bear was massive. Not my greatest kill though, Niobe. But another notch in my belt. <laughs> 20 feet tall. Weighed like 1,900 pounds. It was massive.